so to the trucks today. Well, you've heard how much trouble they were causing. If we just linger a while, you'll see how much uh, they were kicking up. No wonder they start them late, but it does catch those further down the line. And anyone who gets lost gets caught in a dust cloud kicked up by the big boys. Vladimir Shagin taking another stage today, sending into a bit of a battle for the overall record. Stefan Pederhansel has 53 wins now, Vladimir Shagin 52. I suspect Shagin may well be the record holder in total stage wins on the Dakar in history, in a career, by the end of this rally. He just keeps on taking them, does he not? Did it again today, and he extends his lead over Kabarov overall to 38 minutes and 14 seconds. Let's just take a moment to talk about uh, the quads today, shall we, as we haven't seen any pictures. The Petronelli brothers, one and two. Santa Martin in third place, ahead of my favourite, Sonic the Hedgehog, in fourth. Overall, it's uh, Petronelli Senior who is in the driving seat at the moment. Yes, it's uh, Marcos. In fact, it's the younger Marcos. Uh, his brother is in fourth place behind uh, Santa Maria and Gonzalez, just for you. Van Vleit was fourth on the stage, third overall. Johan Elfrink, who we've seen earlier on in the Mercedes, was also cutting it up out there and looking great. This is Van Vleit. Close to one hour behind Shagin on the stage. It really is a dominant performance by Kamaz. Repeated year in, year out, it seems. And it goes on. Beautiful, beautiful cloud spattered blue skies tonight. And time to take a break. And it looks like we might well be having a brief chat in the truck zone. Nice to see the suspensions and just look at the air intake and radiator cooling dams that they have here as well. They are beasts. This is Firidus Kabirov's number 500 machine. Vladimir Shagin is in 501. Presumably named after the jeans. Oh, there he is. <laughs> 